Hi guys, we've got a quick glute workout with a stability ball. You can do this anywhere, so simple. We're gonna work those glutes, those hamstrings, and it's really easy because you're gonna feel it burn. Are you ready? So we're gonna start on our back. Now the key here is you wanna press the small part of your back into the ground so you don't want an arch. Your legs will kinda come up over the ball, feet resting on it here. And we're going to first start with just lifting up, squeezing right here, just holding. Now you're not using your back to hold yourself up. You're squeezing up with those glutes and those hamstrings, really squeezing and just hold, holding right here, getting them active, holding there to make it more challenging. You can lift up your hands, hold it here, concentrating on squeezing, keeping that ball still right here. To make it easier, you can keep your hands down. To take that up a notch, just lift one leg at a time. You're bringing your core into the equation, keeping your balance. You'll definitely feel this in those buns. Squeezing it. Nice. Next, we're gonna take it down. You're gonna place your feet, your heels on the ball, and we're gonna gently lift it up, squeeze, and back down. Now with this, you wanna make sure you're not using your back to lift yourself up and down. Instead, we're just driving through those heels, squeezing, pushing up, using those glutes, those hamstrings, squeeze up, and back down. Nice. Up. Whew. Now there's no magic number or rep set with this. You wanna do it until it burns, and it won't take a lot. We only had a few, and you can already start to feel it. Bring it up. Woo! Down, give me two more just like this. Up. One more, up. Nice. Okay, now from this position, you want to bring your legs out right here. We're gonna work on those hamstring curls from that same initial position. Squeezing it up, we're just gonna curl it in and back out. Whew. In and out. Good job. Make sure you're breathing. Whew. Two more right here. Last one, squeeze it in. Woo! Take a break for a second. Oh, you should feel that. Do you feel it? I feel it. <laughs> now to make that move a little bit more challenging, I just wanna show you something. You can make it a combo move. So it's up, out and hold, back and down. So you're making all of those moves into one giant combo move. Whew, you should really feel that. Okay, the next move I wanna show you, we're gonna take it up all the way to the top. And we're just gonna do a simple standing and sitting exercise, but we're gonna drive through those heels, using those glutes, using those hamstrings for this whole motion. So the ball is just here as a touchdown spot. So we're just sitting down. As soon as you touch down, driving right back up through those heels. You should feel that in those glutes and those hamstrings. Up. Bring it down and up. Nice. Squeeze. Down, up, tuck, and back down. So you don't need a lot of weight. We're just using our own body weight by, by concentrating and really driving through those heels, focusing on those glutes, those hamstrings, you'll really start to feel it. Good job, you guys. Now you can repeat the whole thing again if that was too easy. There's no magic number of reps. You can do it as many times through as you want, but if you really felt it after that, then you're good. Thanks for joining me. I'm Natalie Jill. See you next time.